Well, Michelle, I'm in the thick of it, but I am strategically positioned. Take a look. This is 50th Street looking west. The street is now, for the most part, close to all traffic from 7th Avenue. That's down there all the way east to 5th Avenue. Officials say this is necessary since more than 10 million people are expected to visit just 5th Avenue this holiday season. It is the usual unusual chaos here in Manhattan's Midtown on this holiday season gridlock day. Where are you heading? I'm heading to 100 Wall Street. Ooh, you're right in the thick of it. Yes, I am. Yes, I am. This morning at 11, crews put up barriers <laughs> here on 50th Street between 5th and 6th Avenue, same on 49th, 48th, and 51st. It will stay this way every day through early to mid January from 11 a.m. until midnight. Navigating this maze, was this a mistake coming this way? It was the mistake of my life. It's been too long. I've been on this avenue like 20 minutes already. Less than ideal. We're waiting for our ride. <laughs> There's more. What Mayor Adams hopes will create a more pleasant holiday environment. Starting Sunday and for the next three in the row, Fifth Avenue will be closed to all vehicles from 48th Street to 57th, noon to 6. But right now, the challenge at hand. Did you just give up? I did. Or did it give up on you? Uh, I think a little bit of both. The wicked, wet, windy weather. What happened here? A little rain, a little wind. <laughs> <laughs> and, and all I got to get is the Radio City music off. Wait, look, we're matching now. Right. Uh, we look very good, don't we? <laughs> complicated by all those darn barriers. You go right into all of the puddles. They direct you right into them and right out of them. Oh, and then you have the wet feet. One other person, I met Joe. He's from a small town in Ohio, about 6,000 people. I asked him, what do you think about all this? He said he loves New York City, the Broadway shows, holiday, but he also looks forward to getting back home.